Welcome back to Robominions.in. Today's topic is introduction to graphs. In that we will be looking at adjacency matrix of undirected and unweighted graph. Before tracing the code, I request you to watch this video on your laptop or at least a full size screen on your mobile phone in a horizontal view so that the code is clearly visible. If the code is not clearly visible on your mobile phone, I strongly suggest you to watch this video on your laptop. The app I am using to trace the code is Robominions.in AI interview preparation app. The app gives an option of uh, clicking back and next button on the code tracing and this app is available on the website Robominions.in download latest version by clicking on download latest button and uh, if you have a Windows OS laptop, then download for Windows OS. Let's uh, start tracing the code. We have this arrow which goes to the exact line of execution. So this helps us in tracing. Right now it is pointing at hash include stdi.h. Then we have hash define v5. So this is a macro. So v here is a vertice. Then we have void main. In void main, we have int adjacent adj that is adjacency matrix v v that is here v is vertice which is 5 so 5 5 it's a two dimensional matrix we initialize the matrix by calling the initialize matrix function it uh, it is a, a double for loop which which initializes all the values in the adjacency matrix to 0 okay and then now uh, we have add edge function which we, pa we pass this adjacency matrix and uh, we pass the the row and the column values so row is 0 and column is 1 so let's see so we have so it, uh, it is like adding an edge between 0 and 1 so if 0 is the vertice, 1 is the vertice. So there is an edge between 0 and 1. So that is what is happening. We have adjacency matrix of i and j. Here i is 0 and 1. So adjacency matrix of 0, 1 equal to 1. So the, that has changed in the matrix. And you can see here is the graphical representation. And then we also change as it is an undirected and unweighted graph. We also have to change 1, 0. So 0, 1 and 1, 0 has to be made 1, 1. The reason is it's a undirected graph. So both the location has to be changed to 1. So this and this has been changed. Next we add a, uh, next we see we are adding an edge between 0 and 2. So we have added an edge between 0 and 2. Then uh, 0, 2 and 2, 0 are made 1. So 2, 0 and uh, 0, 2 are made 1. Then we have edge between 0 and 3. So 0 and 3. You can see 0 and 3 have the edge. 3 and 0 have changed to 1. So 0, 3 is 1. 3, 0 is 1. Next we add edge to 1, comma 2. So between 1 and 2 we add the edge. So see 1 and 2 we have added the edge. Adjacency matrix of 1, 2 equal to 1. And then we have adjacency matrix of 2, 1 equal to 1. So 1, 2 and 2, 1 has been made 1. Then we add 2, 3. So between 2 and 3 we add the edge. So we have a 2 and 3. 2, 3 and 3, 2 we have put 1. Then we add edge between 2 and 4. Between 2 and 4. So we will see. So you can see 2 and 4 we have added the edge. 4, 2, 4, 2 and 2, 4 are made 1, 1. Then we add edge between 3 and 4. So 3, 4 we add the edge. 3, 4, 4, 3 is made 1. 3, 4, 3 and 3, 4 are made 1. And then we print the adjacency matrix. So printing adjacency matrix is also a double for loop. So we go through each element and then print the adjacency matrix. You can see here we have uh, clearly printed the values, whichever was updated. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, so if you want to access the code and make modifications to the code, you can click on code button in the app robominions.in AI interview preparation app. The time complexity of this algorithm is order of v square where v is the vertices, the number of vertices we have. So we have 
five vertices 0 1 2 3 4 so totally five vertices to download this app and uh, trace the code yourself you have to download the app from uh, website robominions.in click on download latest version see you guys in next video thank you signing up dhananjay sharma founder of robominions.in don't forget to subscribe to the youtube channel share with your friends and family visit robominions.in website Crack your toughest coding questions and tech interviews by downloading the latest version of the app. And make your coding easy. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.